the pursuit for justice and closure has been something that has been top of mind since February 8th. Um, and a year later, to still not have it, um, it's frustrating, it's disheartening. Melissa Woodards Conley wants justice and closure. She filed a $50 million wrongful death suit Monday against the city of Detroit and the cop who struck and killed her father in a car crash last year. Officer Tierra Funderburg was driving to assist other officers in a non-emergency, non-life threatening situation. The suit alleges that before Funderburg crashed into Cliff Woodard's vehicle at this intersection, dispatchers and even her partner in the scout car told her to stand down. But Funderburg continued speeding to the scene, running a red light and hitting Woodard's car. All the police officer had to do is do one thing right, slow down. Don't go through the red light. How about obeying a command, just one command? We perhaps may not be here sitting talking to you tonight. Attorney Arnold Reed is representing Connolly in the suit. He was close friends with Woodards, who was also a prominent attorney in Metro Detroit. We have a situation here, Randy, where if it wasn't Cliff, then who was it gonna be? You are racing through the city of Detroit. As my father put faith in ju the judicial system, I hope that the judicial system will hold Officer Funderburg accountable. The Detroit Police Department says Funderburg is on unpaid suspension and charged with involuntary manslaughter. She's currently awaiting trial. Meanwhile, Connolly, who is expecting, is holding on to memories of her father and reflecting on the harsh truth he will never meet his granddaughter. My father always called me little girl, regardless of how old. I was and I'm having a daughter and I would give any amount of money in the world to hear my father say little girl one more time whether it was to me or whether it was about his granddaughter. Now, it came out during the court proceedings that Officer Funderburg has a less than stellar driving record, which includes four citations for speeding, one for disregarding a stop sign, and three car accidents, not including the one that took Cliff Woodard's life. We reached out to Funderburg's attorney for comment. No response.